Gregor and seal the door behind you, trapping you in the tower. Uh, I think Alistair's, yeah, Alistair's probably the one who knows most about this, but... Right, Liliana's actually carrying daggers, she sh will switch back to her bow. And... Go stealthy, and we would send the rogues out to sort of scout... Oops. There are many great tales of lost kings who return to their lands to reign in glory. I am not lost, nor for that matter a king. And there's nothing glorious about me. You are Merrick's son. You are the rightful king of Ferelden. I am the son of a starstruck maid and an indiscreet man who just happened to be king. <sighs> Look, I can't be king. Some days I have trouble figuring out which boot goes on which foot. Complete fools are made leaders of... What do you need? Sorry, I was just... This is not really the time for the two of you to... What happened to Edelstan's stealth? This is just not the time for Eliana to be discussing kingship with Alistair. You should be snooping. Eliana, snooping, snooping. Hmm. Looks like dead mages everywhere. Well, I'm not about to steal that stuff, but I'm rummaging through, rummaging through it to try and figure out what happened. That might be something different. Well, that, oh, there's some kind of magic stuff in there. That doesn't. Tell us anything. The locker here. Find a few pages from a diary. Let's see. Well, that's confusing. But, yeah, someone apparently has been, been digging for something deep down in the tower. Find all his notes to reveal a possible secret. Uh, Liliana should probably be snooping, snooping along with me. Um, there's a good deal of stuff here. Let's look at this. Increases user resistance to cold damage. That may certainly be. Okay, we're not picking up people's rings. Unless you have very good reason to. Um, this sort of thing might always be useful, I suppose. Increase the user resistance to cold damage. But it doesn't belong to us. Hey, no, let, let's snip somewhere else, because I don't see anything else that's very interesting in here, to be honest. What about in here? Same sort of thing. Chests, foot lockers, what have you. Ring of cold resistance, well, still doesn't tell us anything about what's happened anyway. Well, 
more pages from this diary apparently. Lessons cancelled. Outburst in the library with old dread. Page on the reading. Ritual notes. Hmm. Gant and Nolan apparently are they. Mages who have been digging into this sort of thing. Maybe that's some of somehow connected. I mean probably get back to Alistair if Oscar Fee knows anything about this. We do actually, we are sort of missing uh, Morrigan now. She would probably make more sense of this. I lost the crap. <laughs> Where's the note? Um, quest related. This one maybe? Oldred set abominations loose. One was in my mentor's robe. If you make it here, something in the spot may help you out. No point in hiding it from senior mages now and don't. About Denry's usual fee for moving his bed. He's dead. Moving his bed. Okay. Someone hid some something behind a movable bed, I suppose. Again, this stuff doesn't belong to us. Clearly, the people who hid something there now thought that. Okay. Well, well, well. Let's we sent everybody over here. And then try and send an Edelstan and uh, Liliana to snoop behind the door if possible. Whoa! Right there. Take another step, and I swear I will strike you down where you stand. Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down, I'm not going to do anything. I am Wynne, Mage of the Circle, and these children are under my protection. Who are you, and what is your purpose here? Have the Templars opened the door? Speak quickly. I'll have no games. Ah. Uh. I better be straightforward here. I'm a Grey Warden. It's not as much that I seek the help as that I want to help you guys. But so maybe I'm helping Gregoire resolve the Circle's difficulties. Um, no. Mentioning Gregoire may be a bad idea. Bad idea since he's guy who closed the door, so I'm a Grey Warden. I seek the help of the mages. And you were told that the Circle was in no shape to help you, I suppose. Indeed. So why did the Templars let you in? Do they plan to attack the tower now? <sighs> Don't worry, this rite of annulment has not arrived, at least not yet. They sent for it then. I feared they might have. What else could they do? So Gregor thinks the Circle is beyond hope. He probably assumes we are all dead. They abandoned us to our fate. But even trapped as we are, we have survived. If they invoke the right, however, we will not be able to stand against them. Well, what happened here, anyway? Let it suffice to say that we had something of a revolt on our hands, led by a mage named Uldred. When he returned from the battle at Ostagar, he tried to take over the Circle. As you can see, it didn't work out as he had planned. 
I don't know what became of Aldred, but I am certain all this is his doing. I will not lose the circle to one man's pride and stupidity. <sighs> well, I'd love to say leave it to me, I'll save the mages, but I've no idea how. So what do you intend to do anyway? I erected a barrier over the door leading to the rest of the tower, so nothing from inside could attack the children. Sensible. You will not be able to enter the tower as long as the barrier holds, but I will dispel it if you join with me to save this circle. We must certainly try to avoid needless slaughter. Yes, even if we cannot eliminate all the demons and abominations, together we could lead the survivors out. Once Gregor sees that we have made the tower safe, I trust he will tell his men to back down. He is not unreasonable. Um. Actually, Gregoire said he would only accept it if the first enchanter says so. Also, will the children be safe here? Petra and Kenan will watch them. If we slay all the fiends we encounter on our way, none will get by to threaten the children. I suppose that could work. Petra, Kenan, look after the others. I will be back soon. Wynne, are you sure you're alright? You were so badly hurt earlier. Maybe I should come along. The others need your protection more. I will be alright. Stay here with them. Keep them safe and calm. Um, yeah, kids around stuff. Have faith. We will not fail. Your confidence is refreshing, though you should make sure it does not blind you to your weaknesses. If you are ready, let us go end this. All right, yeah, so now Wynne here is in our party. Excellent. Um... Oh, I still think, I mean, Alistair's kind of yes. an expert at mage killing, isn't he? And, yeah, we just want the rogue along. And that also means I can't sneak now. Because I was thinking of making just a pure rogue party and trying to sneak around as much as possible. But since Wynn is coming along, that's obviously not going to work. Um, anyway, so, definitely planning on taking... Um, Alistair along. And then, uh, Wynne, I suppose. Oh, yeah, and she has healing spells. I've been. <laughs> That's awesome. We really needed that. Um. There's a stubborn old mage, Wynne, who insisted that there were innocents within who could be saved. Well, she may be wrong, this is probably worth thinking, definitely worth investigating, I'd say. Wynne has joined with you in the hopes that she can still save the circle. You know, this is certainly what the nice guy would do, And uh, but the video has gone on for quite long, so I think I'll join you for the next video. Until then, go in peace and live, love, live.